awesome sword I found, but take a look. Over 2,000. That means I have to take a fucking drink. Mother. It's a good sword. Oh, I have poison damage. <clears throat> I'm gonna use all this stuff up, but when in need of a you know drinking game. <laughs> all right, let's keep going so we can get more gameplay in. My you guys, if you're a heavy drinker, you've already had five. What am I doing to you people? Remember, if you're underage, I really don't want you to be drinking, but I can't be, you know, in charge of how you live your life, so it's just responsible if you are underage. I was worried that the boar was going to, um, be more of a problem. He's actually been doing all right so far. When I, I was testing out these rules before, and I felt it was more balanced when I played it because the boar would die, you know, occasionally, so that would count for a shot. This could be kind of game series, actually. I was, I was thinking once I, you know, finished my finals week and whatnot, I could submit this as a machinima series. You know, Drinking Diablo, pretty catchy name, right? Oh! It might be fun, you know, because gameplays are kind of boring, but if you add a drinking game element to it with the viewer's participation, think about it. It's just such a great idea because I know we all want to play a drinking game while watching a video, right? And there's other classes I could use uh, to test out while I'm playing this. So for your viewing pleasure, I could use a random build. I could do something else like that if you're interested. Um, of course, when I get more time. Right now, this is going to be a one-time video for the time being. Oh god, boar! What are you doing down there? I also have a very high alcohol tolerance, so... Um... I had some beer before this, but... I'm not going to feel anything for a while. I need about five shots to start to feel anything. Um... But it's all in the fun. What are we doing on time here? It's two minutes? Okay, we're actually doing really well. Okay, very good, very good. Now, you're probably saying, if you're a Diablo fan, why is he doing Act 3? Why is he doing Act 2 like a bitch? Exactly. You want me to be drunk? If I did Act 3, I would die so much. Act 3 isn't made for, you know, any type of casual game. Oh! <laughs> you get a drink! <laughs> How lucky for a random opponent to drop a gold. That's so unusual. I have magic find on, though. Sorry. <laughs> I do. What am I going to do? I got to examine what this is. Oh, crap! Ugh. <sighs> Ugh. <sighs> It's not, it's all right. I don't need this, I have a bullet very similar. All right, onward. Onward soldiers. Onward drinking soldiers. And also, if you're playing this game along with me and you're drinking, uh, tell me what drink you're drinking, because that would be awesome. I'd like to know what we're all drinking here. Hopefully it's hard alcohol if you're really of age and playing this game, because you need to feel buzz. It's a pretty good like bow, but in a tomb when you die. No point in that. I'll probably just rot wherever I fall. What the hell is this? That, oh, that was from before. Nice that doesn't count. I dropped that. I didn't pick it up. That's from before. See, y you might be saying it's sad to watch a guy play a drinking game by himself. But this is actually a pretty cool idea because you're playing as well. Um, I might edit this video and get some more gameplay up. So I'm actually going to stop the recording here and move on somewhere else because I think I've covered this whole dungeon. Inside the Dogar Oasis 
and I'm going to try and uh, get into more of a groove that's more fair because in there I was kicking ass so um, I also haven't eaten a lot today so I have a slight buzz right now I guess for since I have my stacks going up this this, en this enhances your chance of finding a gold item <sighs> let's do this so if I find a gold at this point and it's over 2,000 I'll take a drink um, let's see if it's a piece of armor you will drink if it's a weapon I will drink. So if I got a weapon that's over 2,000, I'd take two shots. That's that's where we'll go with that. We'll see if that helps. I, helps. <laughs> you guys have already had like six shots. So I'm, I apologize for the game being a little unbalanced, but I'm still trying to work out the game rules. If you have any ideas for rules, please let me know so I can bring those into future consideration. Get the fuck out. Oh god. And we got this, we got this. Oh, come on, boy. Don't, don't be a dumbass. Don't be a dumbass. Alright, you weren't totally a dumbass, but you were getting close. Oh, this place is a trap. Watch this. All those electric eels will hit me. Oh shit, the boar died! The son of a bitch! That's another shot. Oh. Bottoms up. Salute. If you if you like me drinking on camera, please give me a, a like and maybe subscribe if you're feeling so generous. Ugh. Now, I'm glad to need a lot because it's making the game more useful. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta feel a little bit of a buzz to make this, you know, worth my while. Oh, he's down there. Okay. Oh my God, boar! Don't be an idiot. I need you. I need you. Oh, we got enemies. Yeah, I think it would have been a better idea to start out here because. The boar is more likely to die, and so am I. Okay. How are we doing on time? Three minutes? Come on! No! You fucking dumb animal! God damn it! Oh my god, look at how much I've used here. Short nap under that fern there. Never mind. There appears to be a pile of demon spore under it. Uh, uh, fucking boar. You're costing me a lot of kills, you son of a bitch. I want to slaughter you and make you into bacon. You fucking asshole. Oh god. I want to lag. No, not now, please. Look, he's dying. He's already dying. Fucking dumb animal. Alright, I gotta actually start playing strategically here. Because, um... That was my fourth shot on an empty stomach. I'm getting happy. I am. I don't want to get too happy because I need to be able to 